It's me again. I'm gonna go over my uh, mining rigs so far, or mining rigs. And uh, first thing we're gonna go over is my current speed. So this is what, uh, this is uh, May, I think 15th or 16th. And I'm gonna go over some of the cards I have and show you how fast they work. So these cards down here are the Zotac uh, 1080s. And the, I think these are like the 1080 minis. And the speeds that I'm getting for those this is about, so you can see there's like a 540 and a 490, but the difference is that these little guys down here get 490, these get 540. But then again, keeping in mind that I am uh, throttling down the cards, I'm gonna go to MSI. You see I'm doing 70 power limit, so I'm not even doing 100, or even more than 100. And this saves on amps, and uh, it saves on power and gives me a basically almost the same uh, speed. So if I increase it to 100, then instead of being 545, um, it'll probably be like 570, something like that. So it's not much of a difference, but I save a lot of electricity. And then I um, also wanted to talk about some of the uh, comments I had on the last video, where people were saying, why are you buying, you know, why are you buying screens and why are you buying keyboards and mouse? Okay, I'll, I'll tell you why. This keyboard and mouse costs 20 bucks, or I think it's 15 bucks on Amazon, okay? It costs nothing, all right? That's like, that's like two cents, okay? This screen is 100 bucks, okay? Yeah, that costs some money, but what it gives me is it gives me the ability to just walk by all these computers without touching a KVM switch. I can just walk by and look at all of them at the same time. I don't have to sit here with a KVM switch, switching between each computer, where I can just go like this. I can walk by and be like, okay, this looks good. Okay, these speeds look good. I go to the next computer, these speeds look good. I go to the next computer and so on. Um, and I go through all of them just like that. That's why I bought a keyboard and I bought a monitor, okay? Just to answer some of the questions. And most of the stuff I got is all on Amazon. So you can buy it all on Amazon. All these uh, rigs, all these uh, metal frames, things like that. Like these mouse pads, they're like, I don't know, ten, five, ten bucks. So they're worth nothing as well. So this is all cheap stuff. Now that's someone driving by. Yeah, okay. Let's go over some of the other cards I have. So these are the Strix 1070 cards. All right, and let's see what speeds they get. She got their current speeds getting about 420. So you can see there's a pretty big difference between a 1070 and a 1080. There's a 1080 getting 545, 550, depending on which card, and the Strix getting 420. Now these are also 1080s, Zotac, so that we know their speed. What about these down here? Let's go over these the Cerebros, whatever they're called, and there's an EVJ on there as well. These are 1070s, and let's look at their speeds. Uh, they're getting what, 480, 440, 440, uh, what's this, 450, okay, some pretty much all around the same type of speed. These are actually, no, these are 1070 Ti's. Let me, let me look this up. Let me go to device manager. I think I'm confusing some of the cards. Yeah, these are 1070 Ti's. That's why they're a little faster. I was like wondering, why are they faster? All right. And these down here are also 1070 Ti's. These are EVGA and one and two Strix, two EVGA's. So there should be a difference between EVGA and Strix. Uh, EVGA is always faster than Strix. So you can see it here. We have 460, right? And then we have 480, 460, 480. So the, the EVGA's are 480. And the Strix are 460. Now let's go over to the 1080 Ti's. Um, these are MSI 1080 Ti's. They are probably not the best cards, but I am um, throttling. Um, remember, I'm throttling everything in this whole entire warehouse. So everything is down in speed. So you, you should be getting better speeds than this, but I'm just saving electricity. So I'm getting about 620, all right, for these 1080 Ti's. They're MSI's. Um, now I'll show you the difference between these 1080 Ti's and uh, these other 1080 Ti's, like these EVGA 1080 Ti's, okay, same thing, I'm throttling the same the same way. I look at the difference here. <clears throat> these are getting 480. So 460, 480, what is it, 480, yeah, around there. But the best ones is going to be the Zotac 1080 Ti's. These are Zotac 1080 Ti's and two MSI 1080 Ti's on this rig. So if you go over here, you're going to see that it's 640 for the MSI. And then if you go down to the uh, Zotac, you can see right away it's 700. So it's a big difference between Zotac 1080 Ti because you're getting like 710, 720 compared to 650. It's a huge difference. And maybe, well, actually there's a 670, 680. So there's a big difference between Zotac and MSI 
in the 1080 Ti. So there is no difference if you get like, or very small difference if you just get a regular 1080 Zotac, uh, two fan 1080, and then you compare it to an MSI 1080, there is basically no difference. But when you go to 1080 Ti, there is a difference and Zotac is way better than MSI. Like I'll give you another example here. These are 1080 MSI's. And uh, now see their speed is about 530. See, 530, uh, 530 the MSI, right? Now if I go over here, I have one Zotac and one MSI. And look at this, it's 530 for the MSI. And see this difference is like 530, about pretty much the same, 530, 535. So there is very little difference here in the 1080s. But as soon as you go to 1080 Ti, there's a huge difference. The Zotacs are way better for the 1080 Ti's. All right, well, I think we went over all the different type of cards I have. All right. Oh, I also wanted to talk about uh, this uh, one little problem I'm having for um, some of the, uh, I guess there's like a problem with this motherboard. See if you guys can help me out and comment on this problem. Basically, I have this board right here. And uh, this board, for some reason, is producing like slower speeds. I don't know what it is. Basically, these are Strix 1070s, and they are making 375. 380. They're supposed to be doing 420. So if I go to this, like this is Strix 1070, and I go over here, this is Strix 1070. Same exact motherboard, same exact uh, everything is exactly the same, but down here it's 420. See? 420, 370. It's a huge difference. 50 hash rate for each GPU. So I got what? 246. So 246 is what? 300 hash rates I'm missing off this rig. And I don't know why. I mean, I checked uh, the GPU connections. They're all fine. I checked the uh, uh, power connections, they're all fine. Um, I replaced the CPU, I tried a different CPU, it's fine. I ran a CPU test, uh, stress test, it passed. I, I checked the RAM, I, I tested all the RAM, they passed all the stress tests. So it's not the RAM, it's not the CPU, it's not the, uh, the, um, the what's they're called, the, uh, these little green guys, I forgot what they're called, uh, the risers. It's not the risers, I cleaned all the risers, I plugged all the risers back in, I tried swapping the slots of the, of the, PCI Express uh, risers down here to the motherboard. I tried swapping those. That didn't help anything. So basically there's nothing else left to test. The only thing that's left is the motherboard. That's it. I mean, I tried updating the motherboard BIOS. I tried setting it to Gen 1. I tried absolutely everything that's possible to try to make it run at the proper speeds and it still runs at 360, 370. So if you guys have any idea what it could possibly be, I mean, the only thing I have left is I think it's just the motherboard. But then why is the motherboard running? Like, why would it be running a little bit slower? This just sounds silly. Even if I unplug all the GPUs and leave only one GPU plugged in, it still does 370, 360, 370. It does not do 420. It doesn't matter what I do. So if you guys can help me out with that, that'd be nice. I wanted to fix this rig and I don't know what's wrong with it. All right, please leave your comments in the video. Um, please like and share this video so I get uh, uh, more subscribers, more viewers, and I hope you guys learned something about mining. All right, bye.